about radio. I've got the little gear mounted on the pot and I've got the pot mounted on a little bracket so that's uh, doing everything that I expect it to do. This is uh, a panel meter that I'm planning to use on the project. Uh, it looks a bit beaten up at the moment but um, it's one I've had kicking around for years and uh, it says that it's uh, 100 volt full scale deflection and it says uh, 10,000 ohms per volt. Um, I put a little uh, battery and potentiometer across it and it whizzes across on a one and a half volt battery so uh, it looks as though I've already taken the scaling resistor uh, out of it uh, at some stage in the past but it doesn't matter what it is uh, I can use it uh, I can always modify a meter to uh, to suit but um, anyway I'm going to change this scale um, so we'll open that up the front panel is held in place with little plastic wedges um, I know this because this is a meter or a type of meter that I've used a large number of uh, on the industrial equipment that I used to manufacture um, so that'll come apart um, if you do open up a meter like this the real enemy is um, well <laughs> you <laughs> uh, um, but uh, the real enemy is if you get iron filings down here and I have had um, uh, wire wool on this bench so I'm a, a bit nervous uh, about uh, this but um, I'll try not to get uh, wire wool into it so what I'm going to do is I'm going to change that scale um, I'm desperately trying to work around the camera and it's always a good idea to uh, clean your hands uh, first because uh, when you mark this scale it's the very devil to get clean and slide that up there yeah so uh, things to watch out for um, you see that's uh, a little loose component there and there anyway um, yeah I can see down the back there there's uh, let me zoom in I can't actually see down the back of the camera um, down there there's a, a resistor there's a wire sticking up um, so what I will have done is I'll have had that out of here and uh, uh, taken that wire off the resistor off, uh, the other, uh, off this end of the resistor and put it out so I'm going straight across the meter movement anyway we'll put that to one side and we'll concentrate on the scale so what I'm going to do is, um, at the moment this says, uh, well it's obviously KV, I may leave that on there, uh, but it says uh, 0, 2, 4, 6 and 8, and I want it to say north, south, um, uh, no sorry, north, east, south, west, north. So what I'm going to do first is get rid of those numbers uh, that are on there. Okay, so I'll zoom in and uh, I say I'm trying to, I'm, I'm work. the camera is um, uh, 18 inches above where I'm trying to work and it's, it's going to be a little bit tricky. Um, but I'll try and get this so you can see what I'm doing, but I probably won't do it all. Okay, so um, we're going to be using a, a scalpel and uh, my pencil I'm going to be using the eraser 
So what I'm going to try to do is uh, with an eyeglass Okay, so hopefully you can see uh, that's got rid of the uh, zero. And coming up to the final knock-ins. Don't know if I'm getting my head in this shot, but uh, anyway, you have to take it as it is, guys. Uh, here I've got some uh, lecture set, and uh, had this again for many years, so I'm hoping it's still good. And I think that's the size I'm going to be using. So uh, we want to start off uh, with a north, and again I want to want to make sure that uh, I keep the back of the lecture set uh, free of uh, any debris. Um, what's going on there? So. lining this up so that I've got a, a guideline at the bottom so as I can see it's square and then we'll go for that so there's our first north and we know we need a another one at the other end there you go so I think that looks uh, quite acceptable doesn't it So I think that's um, uh, made a, a tidy little meter of that. I've just come to edit uh, this video and I realise that uh, I've spent the last 20 minutes uh, video in the back of my head and really what I wanted to do was show you how I remove the, uh, the letters. So I've opened up the meter again, taken the scale out and um, I, I'm going to sort of give you a close up and I'll uh, uh, I'll remove this uh, KV. So with the scalpel I'm just gently teasing the uh, the black paint off there. Um, the, these uh, meters sometimes they're silk screen printed but because we had a lot of meters uh, made for us as uh, specials it could be that it was originally uh, letter set I don't know but I uh, just gently gently teasing it off if you uh, remove the paint it's uh, You'll never recover from it if you move remove the white uh, unless you put something over it, of course. I say, do remember to wash your hands before you touch the meter.
I've done this a lot of times to get myself out of trouble with a, a special meter, a special purpose uh, meter because uh, you, uh, there's several weeks delivery sometimes uh, six or twelve weeks delivery for a, a custom made meter uh, so uh, one learns how to uh, <laughs> how to get out of trouble when you've got a, a 20,000 pound machine waiting for delivery and you're held up for a, a meter you uh, you have to uh, learn how to uh, get out of trouble hope I'm still in short I can't see anything on there It'll never be perfect, but if I said I'm having trouble finding it with the eyeglass, uh, it, it give you some idea. Um, so if the paint is marked a little bit, if um, uh, you could always um, uh, just put your company logo or your call sign or something across there. What I'm going to do, because you missed out on seeing the um, uh, uh, these uh, letters go on, I'm going to put my call sign across uh, the meter here. And uh, so we'll start off with uh, a zero, because um, I want it to be somewhere near the middle. So, actual fact, I might start off with the J. My call is Golf Whiskey Zero, Japan X-Ray, Mexico. Um, so if uh, we go about that sort of height there and uh, we'll go with the um, J so effectively I'm starting from uh, what you might call the middle so that's the J uh, we want an X And it's all about spacing and uh, getting it level. If it's not correctly spaced and it's not level, it'll look awful. Uh, but I'm doing this by eye. So uh, we'll see how I go. Ah, what happened there? This is old Letra set and uh, it looks like it might have dried out on me. Now I'll, I'll use that one again. It's, um, uh, why should I let it beat me? That's, uh, I don't think I've got any finger grease on the scale. But that would do it, let's rub a bit harder. That's got it. Okay, well that's the completed meter. Um, I don't think I've got my space in between the, uh, the zero and the J quite right. Um, but it's going to be perfectly adequate for what uh, I want. Anyway, I hope you found that interesting guys. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.